A tournament with a difference on the Ladies European Tour, the Omega Dubai Moonlight Classic. Half the field playing their 18 holes in the daytime, the other half playing it in the floodlights at night time. And it didn't turn out to be a good night for Charlie Ho, a triple bogey eight at the par five 16th on her way to a round of 75, three over par. Four-time Solheim Cup player. Hull then a little bit back as far as the uh, leaders are concerned. Minji Lee, the world number nine, the highest ranked player in the field, a little bit closer. Really is spectacular playing at night time with the cityscape that Dubai produces. Fantastic shot setting up a birdie for the Australian. A round of 72, which after a front line 38 was a very good effort. Her namesake, Alison, had made a 58 a 50-hour journey to get from America to Dubai, and it was worth the trip. A round of 72 from her as well, from the one-time Soheim Cup player. But there were plenty of players breaking par in this opening round. One of them was Celine Boutier. Fantastic at the Soheim Cup at Glen Eagles last year. This was her final approach of the day to the 18th setting up a birdie for a round of 67 for the French player. Shot of the day, well, there's no disputing it really, is that the par 3 17th, 162 yards. Caroline Hedwell, who just picked up her first birdie of the day at the previous hole, having started with 10 straight pars. Well, she did this. She slam dunked it straight in for a hole in one took it to three under par not only that look at that right in the hole and it gave her the ultimate prize of a watch from the sponsors omega and she kicked on from there as well bagging three more four more birdies in a round of 65. seven under par then leading the way laura funchstuck with a round of 67 that was matched by that birdie finish from boutier Lydia Coe also right in contention after a round of 68.